beloved students of grade 1, how are you feeling today? I hope you're feeling good and hope everyone can stay. Welcome back to science class with me, Miss Alice. As usual, before we start our lesson for today, I want to ask you to pray together. So, please sit down nicely and then lift your hands. After that, you have to close your eyes and prepare your heart because we will pray to God. Are you ready? Alright, let's pray together. Dear Lord, thank you for a new day. Please come be with us today. Bless our school, our families, our friends, and our teachers. Help us to study well and be good every day. In Jesus' name, Amen. But today, we are going to learn about plants live in different places. Please take a look on the screen. Plants are found all over the world. And also, plants live where there is light and water. Now, Miss Alice will explain what are plants that live in different places? Plants live in dry places. For example, cactus. You know what is desert, right? In Bahasa, we call it padang gurun. While lotus live in wet places, such as lake. Acacia tree lives in hot places like savanna forest. Anak-anak sudah pernah ke hutan savanna belum? Not yet. Alright, you can see the picture of savanna on the screen. While carnivore lives in cold places. Kids, you can find daisy flowers on mountains and aquatic plants in rivers. Now Miss Alice will explain science class materials unit 1 because next week you will have your first task. First material is about living and non-living things. Now take a look at the picture of things that are alive. Living things are human, plants, and animals. How about things that are never alive? Those are the examples of non-living things. The second material is how do we know something is alive? Living things need something to eat. They can breathe, move, and grow. We are, as a human being, we use our senses. We have five senses. We taste something with our tongue. We hear some 
something with our ears. We see something with our eyes. We smell something with our nose. And we touch something with our hands. Now let's see. The third material is about parts of plants. Those parts are flower, fruit, leaf, stem, and roots. But don't forget there is one more part of plants. What is that? Exactly! It is seeds. Here the examples of seeds, orange seeds, sunflower seeds, tomato seeds. Kids, you have already made a project about planting seeds or growing seeds, right? Now I have a question. What do you need to plant a seed? Coba anak-anak masih ingat nggak? Apa yang kita butuhkan untuk menanam biji-bijian? Very good! We need soil, seeds, pot plant or polybax plant, and we need water. What did you feel when you plant a seed? Did you feel happy? You know what? I'm so proud of you. You made it. Miss Ali senang banget karena anak-anak kelas 1 semua hebat. Keep going kids. Now let me explain what do plants need to grow. Plants need water to grow. Do plants need light to grow? Of course. Plants need light to grow. Let's continue to discuss the fifth material for your task. It is eating parts of plants. Alright kids, I have already explained about plants that we can eat, right? Miss kan waktu itu udah pernah ya menjelaskan bagian-bagian tanaman apa yang bisa kita makan. Let me review a little bit. Stem, for example, celery. Seledri ya, in bahasa Indonesia. Leaves, for example, spinach. Bayam. And roots, for example, carrots. Seeds, I give you an example, red beans. Flower. For example, broccoli and fruits. For example, tomatoes. But you can find another examples about parts of plants that we can eat. Nah, anak-anak, nanti kalian coba cari contoh-contoh lain ya. What are another examples of eating parts of plants? And the last material is. Plants live in different places. Nah, nanti anak-anak coba ya pelajari lagi what are plants that live in different places. Kalian bisa lihat di video ini yang di awal, oke? Okay? Alright class, I think this is the end of our lesson for today. I hope you are understand. And if you have a question, please text me on my WhatsApp number. Or maybe you can send me a direct message.